Hello guys and welcome to another video of my PHP tutorials and in this video I'm going to show you how uh, to upload uh, a picture or uh, better we already made a video about that uh, how to upload a picture in the register form uh, what I'm going to show you is how to use uh, and um, how to that picture that you use appear as a user uh, session uh, picture okay so in each and every um, page of the website when you are logged in you will see a picture okay the picture that you choose and the register form uh, and your name okay saying Victor's session or um, whatever name uh, you typed okay so to do that uh, we have here just a second let me put this a little bit increase the size so we have uh, now a logged in user let's let's go out let's go home or sorry let's go let's log out log out dot php session destroyed okay so now I'm going in with Rocky Balboa and the password is Balboa. Log in. Okay, Rocky Balboa's session. Um, and what I have here is the name, okay, the name of the um, of the session, okay, which is Rocky Balboa and the logout uh, link but what I want here is when I register we've made here uh, an input to choose a picture if I choose a picture and then register that picture is going to be stored in your server okay so we will have to create for each and every user uh, a new uh, directory so if you go to, this is a very 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 cool feature that I'm going to show you how to do uh, which is create directories okay so um, with a PHP simple PHP script whenever uh, a user registers a new directory will be created automatically okay for uh, to store uh, that users uh, either pictures or you can make that uh, user to be able to store uh, whatever files he wants to upload to your um, to your server okay so if you if you go to XAMPP directory okay and you go to htdocs and this is our um, virtual server that XAMPP creates we have here our test side um, directory if you go there I already have here um, profiles but I want I'm going to delete this okay and you'll see that after uh, we've created a new script in the insert oops okay uh, it's not possible to delete because he's probably using some of the pictures because I already um, I already created a script to test it and it worked so to delete this what I have to do is come right here and close my uh, Firefox and let's see okay it's out so we have a bunch of files PHP files okay that um, where we have our scripts to run our website and now uh, whenever uh, a new user a new user registers uh, a profiles um, directory will be created automatically and inside that it will be created for each and every new user that registers it will be created a, a directory with his name okay and uh, I'll show you that later on so let's go and open notepad now and the files that we will uh, edit 
are insert.php and session.php okay and we are going to start by in insert.php let's scroll down and in here before move uploaded file uh, we have to create um, a new line of code that uh, we never did before which is the make deed um, make directory function built-in function in PHP which builds uh, automatically new directories okay so uh, before we have to create um, directory variable directory okay and equals to and pay attention because this is very important we have to type dot okay so this will append this new um, directory okay the directory is profiles and now we will type name and uh, images okay and what this uh, is holding is uh, is a variable directory uh, which is holding uh, a profiles okay this is a new directory that uh, PHP will create profiles slash name which is whenever uh, a directory that will have whatever name here is posted by the user so it 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 will create a, a new directory with his own name okay so and then uh, inside name so if I type if I register with name Victor it will be profiles slash directory name Victor slash images okay and inside the images is where we will place our um, profile picture okay so now uh, semicolon here and in here we will um, need to type make dir function okay and this is uh, what we'll need to put inside it first we have to put the directory where that you want to create <coughs> okay so this is the directory that I want to create and uh, comma 0777 <coughs> um, and this number is the schmod mode that we want for the directory okay so if you don't know what schmod uh, means you can go and search that in the web ch mod okay uh, these are types of different um, uh, directories that uh, we can uh, create okay so you can search that if you don't know how to to identify a different um, schmod for a directory okay so comma again and now we type true okay and what this is going to do is create this new directory here okay so now what we want to do is um, is change some things that we have already here which is in here images pick uh, we have to change this let's leave my picture because my picture is the name uh, of the uploaded file and images we can leave that as well but we need to put um, this thing here because is where it's going to be uh, the new picture file so profiles profiles and name okay and basically um, that's it and down here what a preface let's change that this will be your profile picture and in here 
let's change this to 50 50 50 and in source we have also to change this so let's type here profiles and uh, oops sorry name images my big okay perfect so that's it um, that's it for insert.php so now we have to go to session.php okay and this is um, session.php is a little file that uh, or a little script that is going to be in each remember that uh, in the last video we did include the session.php this script in each and every page at the top okay so what this does is output the name um, of the user that is um, using that session at that moment okay and so you see here we echo that session and then we have also the logout uh, link and this is where we will going to output the picture as well okay so in every uh, web page that uh, you are using in the CRUD test site it will appear uh, your name and your picture okay so this is like um, a little bit like a, a social network um, like Facebook uses uh, the picture of each session uh, user okay in the page so um, let's go here and else in here we have to type um, a variable called dear dear equals and now we type the directory and the directory is profiles and then the name okay the name of the user and to do that we can use now the session name okay so to use that we have to type um, here the dot to aggregate session variable which holds the name and uh, concatenate uh, double quotes and uh, the next was images and that's it and uh, let's see let's go down here now and type open which is a new variable which will hold a new line of code that we never did before as well which is open directory okay and what this does is will open the directory that um, we want okay so the directory that we want is this one here so we type in here the fa the variable dir okay and we always have to open the dir if we want to choose uh, whatever file is in there okay so I want to choose and output the file uh, which is inside images for each session name for each user which is going to be the picture file um, or the profile picture so open dir and now to uh, see whatever um, file is in the images directory I'm going to do a while a while loop so let's type file equals read dir which is another built-in function uh, for uh, reading directories so this function will read the directory open okay which is open dir which is this one here okay and uh, so open and this is going to be while files read did open is not equal to false so if exists that directory if it has something in it um, I want to echo I want to echo let's say 
files. So let's see what this does for now. So let's open our let's open our browser and let's go to localhost. localhost test site home and in here or in here I want to register as a new user so what I'm going to type here is let's say um, Maradona 10 and Maradona 10 hotmail.com and password is um, Marad oops oh my god 1 2 3 4 5 1 2 3 4 5 browse and I have a little picture here of Maradona and uh, open okay hopefully this will uh, there it is okay this will be your profiles profiles picture uh, you have successfully registered login now okay let's uh, change this profiles profile picture so we have to go here and go to insert.php and where is this like here this is going to this will be your profile picture okay if we refresh not now refresh this resend okay it doesn't matter let's go to let's go back oops let's go home and here Maradona 10 and in here 1 2 3 4 5 if I log in I go in and what happens here is that I have the images.gpg already placed in the created the new created directory and how do I know that because if I go here let's go to our test site and you see um, htdocs test site and you see that a new directory has uh, have been created profiles if I click profiles I have Maradona 10 okay a new directory for a new user images and if I click images I have my uploaded uh, image perfect okay um, so image images dot gpg okay what I want now to do is to uh, I want to um, take uh, this name and uh, output it as a file in here and to do that uh, let's go to notepad and here in session I have to go here and type uh, an if statement okay and this is an if statement that you'll need to uh, use because um, to avoid some little confusion about the dots to move in the uh, from moving directory but um, just bear with me and copy this and you'll have no problems at all so file not if file is not equal to a dot or file is not equal to two dots and file is not oops it's not equal to the thumbs uh, dot db uh, echo and what I'm going to echo is more is it okay is um, 
uh, image border equals uh, one you can say with equals single quotes equals uh, 50 and height equals 50 and the source this is important the source this is where the file is going to where the echo or the image uh, tag is going to get the file so we have to say that we want the file to be searched in here okay which is the deer we can use the deer deer slash the name of the file okay so the file is going to be neither a dot neither two dots or thumbs dot php if you pay close attention we have here if I refresh I have here um, thumbs dot db uh, will be always be created automatically okay uh, so I want to avoid to output this and this little this points here one and two points okay so whatever image I have dot gpg or dot whatever it will be that is the one um, file that will be outputted as a, a picture so okay I think that's it so here I have to close this and here semicolon and down here let's save this down here let's leave that like that so let's go back and if I refresh now undefined variable on line 15 uh, undefined variable on line 15 which is the oops here let's change this instead of files is file save that let's go back refresh and I have here the picture but I still have files somewhere so files is in here let's refresh let's go back refresh and perfect I have my picture and Maradona's my name okay perfect and now what I want to do is give it a little space here so you see also you can change uh, the size of the picture if I want for example let's say 70 70 by default it will be outputted as uh, 70 see okay I'm going to give a little space here and to do that what I have to do is where is it in here I have to type uh, the magic uh, NBSP okay and this will give a little uh, space there so if I refresh there is it okay and if I go to edit user I still have uh, the picture there let me push this a little bit up and you'll see better and if I uh, delete user I also have uh, the session there if I go to search Maradona session and the picture there so if I log out session destroyed okay so that's how we can um, we can do uh, for each every user to have his own picture whenever he's in session okay and in the next um, video uh, I'm going to show you how you can um, uh, change okay or update your picture uh, of your profile whenever you want okay so see you guys in the next video bye